Hey, good morning. This is Matt Rinkowski. Uh, it's October 2020. We're in mid-Missouri. I want to visit with you a little bit about a persimmon grafting project that's been, uh, that I've done in 2020, in the spring of 2020, that was supported by USDA SARE and the University of Missouri Extension. Um, here's the concept. Um, if you're interested in native persimmon um, fruit production, you can go buy a tree that's been grafted with an improved variety on top, or you can utilize existing seedlings on your farm. And that's what this project is about, to utilize already existing um, seed stock that, that, that are growing on your farm that are already adapted to your land, therefore they should do well, and some of them are larger in diameter, which makes wedge grafting somewhat um, difficult. So we're gonna use a bark grafting technique on large diameter native persimmons. Let's walk over and look at one specifically. Remember, this is October. I did this graft in May. This is about a three inch tree where I grafted. And in this case, I decided to go with two scions. Uh, most people suggest that to make sure that you will have success and in this case, both of them worked. And what I want you to see, this by the way, is an improved variety called Dollywood. And even though when you use a, graft, a bark grafting technique, you're just making a slit in the graft and you're really only affecting a very small part of the, of the tree, of the cut you made, uh, look how um, the, the graft has basically, the scion is basically fused to this three inch tree, both of them, you can see how it's really spread out and made a nice sturdy base for the scion to grow. And you can see in this case, both of these have grown about two feet, if not more, which is impressive and yet fairly common with um, the grafting that I, I, was, I did this year. So this is, the, this is the result of the grafting in May in October, you've got two nicely robust um, uh, scions that have created a very nice uh, beginning for making this into a fruit producing tree.